all right so today is february oh no it's not oh my god what is it january january i don't know but anyway i don't even know what day it is i took a half a day january 20th to spend time with this guy here yeah and i did something really cool i created an image and i invited him onto a i would say online date, date. Well, it said date night, but it really is a date day. So, we're going to be posting some cool, fun videos. All right, I'm going to ask you a question. Mm -hmm. You can ask it, doesn't mean I'm going to answer it. Well, you got to okay. for the people. So, when you hear the statement that love is not rude, love is not rude, what comes to mind? Nothing. Babe. Well, because I've never heard that before. So. You never heard love's not rude? Love's not rude means if you love a person, you won't be rude to them. What? Say that again. If you love a person, you wouldn't be rude to them. Yeah. So in a marriage context, there throughout the day, many times, couples are rude to each other. And so in the context of... Why? Life, because of frustrations, aggravations, just maybe responding like too fast you know responding out of your emotions and you're not even realizing that you're responding out of the frustration of that moment right and so love but that's the, not the root so what's the root the root is selfishness well then we can add to that that love is not selfish you can but let's talk about the context we'll talk about love is not selfish tomorrow but today we're going to talk about love is not rude okay so i'm not saying you're rude if anything, I feel like I deal with that more than you. <laughs> do I deal with that more than you do? I plead the fifth. Because <laughs> I feel like I respond out of, like if I'm working and it's like stressful and I'm in my computer and I'm just plugging away and you come up and ask me something, I'm like, huh, what? Like I'm just, I'm not meaning to be rude, but do I come across rude sometimes? You can be honest. Can I be honest? Yep. <laughs> so probably sixty-five to seventy percent of the time. No, babe, you're not supposed to tell people that. I'm just saying, just period. You like, just said be honest. No, I didn't ask for percentage percentages. Like that's part of being honest. No, that's too much information. So okay, so you saying six, babe? That's not, babe. That's not true. I'm not rude sixty percent of the time. Babe, that's not true. You lying for. I, I am not lying. I rebuke this lying demon. That's not Jesus. I am not lying. Babe, are you, babe, I can't do this. I, that's not true. That's not. Well, if you don't want with the truth, then turn it No, that's on. not true. You don't want to. Babe, babe, will you, babe, will you? Mark, listen, you got exposed. It's okay. Can we qualify rude now? Like, can we speak? You did already. No, okay, let's qualify and rude. You want to be left alone. That ain't rude. That's just an introvert. Is it? You are not an introvert. Yes, I am. You used to be. No, I am an introvert. I derive my energy from being alone and reading a book in the back of a room somewhere. It's it, you derive you determine whether or not you're an introvert or extrovert based off of like if you're in a room crowded people, do you get energized when you leave that room or do you feel drained? For me, I feel drained, overwhelmed, and you know that after a while, I'll be like, it's time that's to go. Because you entertain. Right, because I want people to have a good time and stuff like that. But let's we di we digress. So, all right, I would use out of both of us, I'm rude, <laughs> der. He apparently, so can be. I can be ruder. No, I, no you are. I can. Be I can rude. be ruder. You are ruder, rudest. I can be ruder than you. You are rude. You're the rudest. Babe, that's don't. No, I can be ruder than you. Let's just leave it right there. So I can be ruder. No, you are ruder than me. No, you not. You okay, can. all right, all right. I'll own that. I am ruder than Arnold, but that is something I need to work on. And so the way I'm going to commit to y'all, um, y'all going to be our accountability uh, counselors, right? So the way I'm going to work on that is sometimes I need to respond slow. So instead of responding in the moment, I might take, he's got to be okay showing grace and saying. I don't have a problem. Uh, All right, if I say, babe, hold on, give me a second. Babe, give me a second. Then you can't be like, well, I need an answer right now. You, you I know? don't do that. I'm You're... just saying. I'm just saying. I'm not saying you do. I'm just saying. Okay, but you can't be like, babe, give me a second. Give me a second. 
But I'm thinking. Start scrolling on your phone. No, I'm something. thinking. I'm thinking about it. Sometimes I need to do something else. Read then, emails. Uh, then that's how I process. But you can't tell me how to process. So I say, hey, babe, give me a second. Uh, and then you fine. cool with that? All right, y'all heard I've it? always been cool with that. Okay. So I'm going to respond slower. It. I'm going to respond slower. That's going to help me to be not as rude in my responses in our marriage. And we're going to come back with another topic that love is not... I think you brought up selfish. So I wonder who's more selfish. Love is not a lie. We'll see.